that's John Simon Holt. And they jump away then for their Sun Chariot Stakes. And it might just be a steady pace early on, and uh, that could play into the hands of uh, last second, who's got a strong finishing kick. And it's Vince Salserville that bowls into the lead from Flame Valley. And they're just ahead then of Miss Universal, the orange jacket towards the outside. Distant Oasis tucked in out of the breeze in fourth place, the dark green jacket. Wandering Star is close up there, followed through by Spout, then last second towards the outside. Berenice follows these. And the French Raider, Miss Tahiti, wags the tail as they race inside the Rowley Mile now and it's been Salserville by a half length to Flame Valley. Miss Universal lies a handy third then followed by Distant Oasis and Wandering Star. Last second lying about sixth place at this stage followed next by Spout the last two Berenice and Miss Tahiti. Still a pretty steady looking pace in this Sun Chariot Stakes and it's been Salserville that's setting it as they head down inside the final three quarters of a mile. Racing in second the red colours Flame Valley the outside then left of picture orange Miss Universal in dark green the inside distant oasis followed next by wandering star and last second towards the outside heading for the final half mile now it's going to be a sprint finish Vince Salserville leads the way here's Graham Good in the grass and Flame Valley 32 from Sevens at the off in second place there poised to challenge but uh, George Duffield bringing last second out wide the Frenchman's got to get going yet there he is pushed along at the back of the pack uh, that's Miss Tahiti and they're fanning across the track as they come down past the three furlong marker we're next to the rails Bint Salsabil still just at the head of affairs and then Flame Valley Miss Universal last second is wide Miss Tahiti starts to get going Distant Oasis won't be winning Berenice is under the whip Spout's coming with a right wide uh, run and they've got uh, under a quarter of a mile to go and it's still Bint Salsabil here comes last second the green and orange and yellow cap on the outside further wide is Spout down into the dip and it's last Last second for George Duffield into the lead now. And last second quickening up in good style. Last second's going to hold this. Spout comes through for second at the line. Last second is the winner. Spout is in second place. And then into third came Flame Valley in front of Vince Alsabille and then Wandering Star, Miss Universal, Miss Tahiti, Berenice and Distant Oasis, who was last of all. And so the result of this, the Sun Chariot Stakes, it's gone to number two last second in the colours of Mr. Faisal Salman, trained here at Newmarket by Sir Mark Prescott and George Duffield has uh, ended probably one of the worst losing runs he's ever had on this 9-4 to four favourite, who, uh, whose form was uh, given a confidence boot in France, wasn't it, last time? And a big gamble for the coronation that only just failed. But she really does, as Simon said, have her finishing kick, was used to great effect here, and this daughter of Alzeo quickened away from them in good style. Second horse home is number one, Spout, win by Patery. Third, that's number six, Flame Valley, managed to scramble into a place for each way punters disappointment of the race for me was Tahiti a group one winner last year never got into it at all <laughs>